I never stopped painting. I started when I was 12 years old, and it's a habit, and I just keep doing it. <laughs> uh, because I, I think I'm getting better at it. I have grown over the years in my work because I've stuck to it, and I never gave up, never. I always painted. When the kids were little, I painted, when they were in nursery school, when they were in regular school. Part of when I was growing up and in my teen years, my mother only painted landscape in the summer, and that's when we, the family spent the most time together. So I would go out with her when she was painting outside, and I would draw or paint. Just, she was just probably trying to keep me busy. So it was an important part of my development. Light really invigorates the painting. And somehow, through the colors I use, there's a light in the painting. And if there isn't, I change the color of the sky because the sky reflects a lot of light from the sun. Skies that turned out to be orange or red or purple or whatever color that worked with the rest of the composition. Brenda created a unique kind of iconography or image that was her own image, and they, they, she stayed with that. What stands out in her work is, is the sense of atmosphere Isolation, I would say, is very much part of, of what her paintings are. They're unpeopled, they're fields and spaces, very distinctive, very much true. The thing that really moves me to paint is usually the light, and it's kind of what my painting is about. Color as light is how I think of it, and for me, I'm... The, the light on the cape, people have always said it, but it really is special, and it's part of what makes this place magical, and it's part of what has made it a draw for artists for all these years. Her work is subtle and atmospheric. It's, it's a great combination of a refined technique and an open spirit. I just like the feeling of painting outside. So it's part of the whole gestalt of it. Trying to paint and the sky is changing and the tide is coming in or going out. So you just have to be so fast. And then also just try to keep a certain amount in your memory. And the light is changing. So you're basically painting something that's moving in every way. My work is exciting to me because the structure of the work changed. And uh, I use the sky and the landscape differently. There are all kinds of inventions that one can use in painting landscapes. And the landscape and the houses are shapes to me that together create a balance of color and of nuance, and that's what it's all about. <laughs>